Hello friends, in this video we will discuss about what to prepare for CSIR NET chemical science exam. It's for the first time that someone is uploading on what to prepare for CSIR NET exam. Many a times we are misled by some of our teachers and friends that we have to prepare at least two subjects like organic and inorganic or organic and physical chemistry in order to clear net exam. I solemnly tell you this is very much wrong. We cannot study the entire syllabus given in a particular subject. Our hair will turn grey but still we will not be able to complete a single subject. Wait a minute, then what to prepare for net exam? We need to study some important topics from all the subjects of organic, inorganic, physical and analytical chemistry. Under inorganic chemistry, we need to study the following topics. The first one and my favorite is the Borain chemistry and Wade's rule. I have uploaded so many videos based on these. Check all the question paper. You will get two to four questions based on this. Under this topic, you need to study how to assign Closo, Nido, Arachno and Stike's number, etc. Second topic you need to cover is a John Teller effect. Very often it happens that you will get a question on this topic. The next topic to be covered is bond order. Under bond order, you need to be prepared for bond order for simple diatomic molecule, bond order for rhenium and molybdenum complexes, bond order for metallocenes and bond order for d-block elements. Check my bond order series videos for the same. The next important topic to be covered is isomerism in octahedral complexes and square planar complexes. Every net exam has a question on this topic. I have uploaded a video with complete information on this topic. The next important topic that you need to research on is bio-inorganic molecules. Three to four questions based on this comes in every net exam. Under bio-inorganic molecules, you need to study these molecules. Cisplatin, ferritin, apoferritin and transferrin, function of MN in photosynthesis, carboxypeptidase, carbonic anhydrase, liver alcohol dehydrogenase, chlorine, vitamin B12, ionophores, ferredoxins, gadolinium salts and gold salts, hemoglobin and myoglobin, rubridoxin, race case protein, cytochrome C, siderophores, hemerythrin, hemocyanin, nitrogenase, superoxide dismutase, Wilson's disease, molybdoenzymes. The other important topics that you need to study will be discussed in the next video. I hope you like this video and leave a comment below and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.